Hey, what's going on guys? I just finished my workout and guess what? I'm having my post-workout shake and my post-workout little meal, all right? And I was like, why shouldn't I talk about a nice video about the importance of having a post-workout meal, all right? A lot of people would think that it's all right as long as you hit your macros, you don't need to necessarily eat after you work out, but I disagree with that. If your goal is weight loss, maybe it wouldn't be a big deal, but if your goal is prioritizing building muscles, you want to prioritize your performance, you want to get the best results while well, having a post-workout meal is super important. So what am I having here? I have a protein shake, two scoops of protein with uh, five to 10 grams of creatine, and then I have my banana bread. So check out my recipe on my banana bread. It's on YouTube. I have that every single day. Basically, it's a smashed banana, four eggs, and 80 grams of oats, mix it all together in the microwave. Tastes super good. Good high carb uh, little snack that I have every time post workout, digest super fast for me, super easily with my protein. All right. So, right now, 10, 20 minutes after my workout, I already am feeding my body. It's going straight to my muscles. All right. My muscles are absorbing them like a sponge. All right. And I'll tell you why it's important. First, first of all, when we go to the gym and exercise, let's say you're training hard, you're pushing it at the gym doing 60, 90 minutes, all right? It's a stress on your body. Working out is still a stress on your body when you're really pushing and giving your max. So when you finish training after 90 minutes, most people start feeling a little bit anxious. You start feeling stressed because you're putting that stress on your body and then leaving the gym and going around for two hours without eating, you're keeping that stress super high, which is not ideal for your body. Your body's gonna start breaking down tissue, fat or muscle, to produce energy, your body is not in an ideal state to be anabolic, to build muscle, all right? So it's not ideal for you. As long as, as soon as you finish your workout, you gotta have something straight after your workout, let's say max within 30 minutes, a good carb source that digests fast and a protein source, it will lower your stress right away and it will feel your body, uh, feed your body. Second thing, your muscle glycogen. So after training, you uh, when you work out, you're using those fuels that are the muscle glycogen in your muscles, all right? Look at them as uh, like fuel that you put in your car, all right? So you just use those fuels. You wanna replenish them right away. It's gonna help you recover better, help you optimize your results, and also help you absorb those nutrients better, all right? After you work out, your muscles are starving. They're like a dry sponge that will absorb uh, the nutrients right away. So don't neglect your post-workout meal, your post-workout shake. Go for a carb source with an easy to digest protein source. I always have a protein shake because you don't wanna be eating chicken and most of the time you're not hungry after a workout. So I drink my protein, the protein, whey protein, whatever protein that digests well for you, all right, that you feel uh, you're digesting well. Whey protein will absorb fast and then a good source of fast digesting carbs. You don't want to have something that is super hard to digest. Let's say, I don't know, brown rice. It's full of fiber. It's got to kind of bloat you. It doesn't get absorbed super easily. You can have something like white rice, cake. You can have a banana, a ripe banana. I like making my oatmeal cake, all right? It tastes very well and it does have some eggs too. Yes, it will slow the absorption, absorption because of the uh, yolk in the eggs, but it's all right. I'm not too uh, specific about that. I get my carbs. I have some protein in there and protein in there. So at the end of the day, I'm feeding my body. My body's asking for that food. Trust me. As soon as I finished my workout, I was like super stressed. And now 15, 20 minutes later, I'm having this and I'm feeling uh, renewed. All right. So don't neglect your post-workout shake, your post-workout meal. It's one of the most important things, especially when you're on a cut. When you're dieting, you never want to take away calories from your post and your pre-workout meal. So those two meals are the most important because you want to make sure that you're optimizing your sessions. Even when you're dieting, even when you're cutting, you want to make sure your sessions are 100%. So why take out calories from your pre-workout meal, which will right away affect the way you feel in the gym? All right. I'd much rather you take out calories from other meals, let's say in the evening. All right. So that's it for this video. Don't neglect your post-workout meal. Super important if your goal is optimizing your results and having the best results. Take care, guys. Don't forget to leave a like and I'll see you guys soon. Ciao.